Hi and welcome to Homestead Diary. So I don't know if uh, anyone is following at all with uh, all the stuff we're doing. We have tons of stuff going on, but one of the things that we have been working on is this turkey. It had Bumblefoot so bad that it couldn't walk and it still can't really walk, but it's Bumblefoot is getting much better. You can see how he's eating. He seems to be pretty happy. He's been off antibiotics for uh, almost a week now. And I believe that's how long it's been. I have to look back at the videos to see what day we got him. I think it was last uh, uh, Tuesday. So maybe it's been exactly a week. It may have been last Tuesday night. So we might be at a week. So we had we done surgery last week. I changed out his bandages uh, today. Um which seems like it's been a long time, but I was watching his bandages and they were doing really well without him um, getting uh, more infection. Uh, they were reducing swelling and stuff like that. So I'm pretty happy with it. Now his, his right foot right now looks large, but he has two large uh, napkins in there full of um, uh, turmeric, uh, raw honey and cayenne and iodine. And so his left foot was the one that is much larger and he is, uh, he seems to be doing good. So I'm going to add, uh, this is uh, mineral salt and ascorbic acid that I'm going to add to his water to try to increase his, um, uh, his, uh, immune system. So, um, I'm going to do that. Let me see if I can set this up. Pretty simple. Okay, put some of that in the water. Might okay. see if he likes the water now. He's been drinking quite a bit, so he might not drink more. And I put some in my goat water in here so let's see let's change the light a bit I have to go through the other door over here to get out huh okay so turkey's doing really well daisy got out which i was going to put some in her water but now i'm going to take some of this water there we go every little bit okay you've been putting your feet in here so i think you're fine Okay. Hey, Daisy. Okay, Daisy. You want to come back in? Mm-hmm. Hey, kids. So this is Theodosia and uh, Birch. And they're kind of quarantined because they're not feeling too good so ascorbic acid and some salt so is daisy so we have three in the trailer oh daisy okay don't eat all the turkey's food come on come on this is goat this is the goat life and i have 15 up in the In the single wide, 
And there we go. There's that. So good. So yep, we got them some water. Oh, yay. Whew, I feel better knowing that he's doing well. He seems to be eating well. Haven't had a problem with that. He hasn't been on antibiotics, like I said, in about a week. Well, actually more, because it would have been a week that he was, should have started antibiotics, and then it was three days. So 10 days he's been off antibiotics, and he's doing, I mean, really well. Look at him. He's so happy about the food. Mm-hmm. So... He'll stay out here tonight because it's not going to rain. But if it rains, uh, we have him in the trailer with the goats. And he does fine. They kind of like hang out. And he seems to be fine with that. But since it's not going to rain and I have my livestock guardian dog, uh, Terrence, that would come around and, and take away any uh, threat, you know, because he can't walk. And so he's very vulnerable right now. But I think he really likes it in the grass. He likes it being outside. He likes the, the activity during the day. I bring him out during the day, and when it's raining, I bring him back in. But I think he's good tonight. I'm going to leave this light on, and he'll have plenty of, of energy to, to, like, look around or sleep or whatever he wants to do. So he's just eating away. Yum, yum, yum. Can we see your can we see your other foot, honey? Can we see it just a little bit? Over here without you tipping too hard. So, oh, yep, his uh his ba oh, balance is off. Sorry, buddy, sorry. So you can see his other foot. I mean, it was when I first got him humongous. It's definitely uh down a little bit. Sorry, sorry. He's basically off balance. Let's put you a little bit closer to your food then. Do you want it different? You want it to be like that? Okay. Good. You eat as much as you possibly can. June bug. Not not a cockroach. June bug. June bug. There are, it's June bug season. They're out, they're everywhere. Okay, how about you go over here? Miss Ju Mr. June bug, Mrs. June bug, whoever. I guess the June bugs, the, uh, I think it's the females, or maybe it's the males. Wow, that's so bad. Have like really long, like lashes, really long, uh, like yeah, eyelashes. That's how you can tell the male and female apart. Maybe it's the males that have the big eyelashes on June bugs. Anyway, nobody's going to be watching this anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I'm just so proud of my Tom turkey. Oh, he's so happy. <sighs> he's eating. Well, I hope you have a blessed day. I'm going to go eat dinner with my family. Yay.